Hi everyone, I'm Akansha with the Great Pet Care product review team and today I'm going to be talking to you about dog carrier backpacks, specifically what kinds of backpacks there are and which are the best kinds available in the market today. A hands-free dog carrier backpack may be good for you if you like to adventure and you have a pup that also likes to adventure but may not be able to keep up with you all the time. A hands-free dog carrier backpack is also really great and useful if you have an elderly or a disabled pup and you still want them to live their best lives and come along to adventures with you um, and it's a great way to have them with you and keep them safe at the same time. There are many different kinds of dog carrier backpacks available, but before we talk about the different kinds of them, let's just talk about what exactly a dog carrier backpack is. So a dog carrier backpack, unlike a traditional dog carrier, is specifically designed to carry pets safely on your back, like this one, which is very similar to a regular backpack, or to carry pets in front where the animal sits in the bag, and some bags allow you to have the dog's head and legs hanging out, and the straps go on the front of your body. Hands-free uh, dog carrier backpacks also give pet owners a lot more mobility when they're doing activities like hiking and biking. Um, they're also really useful when you are taking your pets on public transportation or if you're trying to get through the airport with ease. These backpacks come in different sizes and although the majority of them cater to smaller dogs, there are some backpacks that can accommodate larger dogs. When introducing the carrier to your pet, it's best to introduce it to them slowly, associate it with fun and reward, and let your dog get comfortable with it first before you try and carry them in it. So when looking for a dog carrier backpack, the three things that you really wanna consider are comfort, durability, and of course, functionality. In terms of comfort, you want to make sure that the bag is comfortable both for yourself and for your dog. For yourself, you want to make sure that the bag has padded shoulder pads and it has a chest or and waist uh, strap so that you can evenly distribute the weight of your dog across your back. And then for your dog, you want to make sure that there's lots of mesh windows throughout the bag so that they can be comfortable in the bag. And you want to make sure that the bag has a soft inner lining inside so that your dog can sit comfortably inside the bag. Make sure to get a backpack that's the right size for your dog so that your dog can be comfortable inside it and still be able to move around, but not a backpack that's too big such that your dog is going to be jostled around inside the bag. Now in terms of materials, you really want to pick a backpack that has high quality materials and good functioning zippers and closures for any dogs that might be escape artists. You want to look for smooth, seamless edges on the inside and you want to make sure that there's nothing sharp that could be uncomfortable for your pet to lean in uh, once they're inside the bag. And for active users, you're really looking for a lightweight product with lots of mesh windows that will be most comfortable for you to carry on your back when you're going on your hike with your dog. In terms of functionality for long hikes or walks, you want to make sure that you get a bag with good shoulder straps and ideally with both the chest strap and a waist strap to keep the weight of your dog off your back. And if you're planning to travel with your pet on a plane, it might be a good idea to invest in a bag that will easily fit in under the seat in front of you. You might also want to consider getting an expandable bag, which uh, zips up and opens up to give your dog more room in the bag. Roller backpacks give you the option to carry your pet or roll them gently when your shoulders get tired. And for dogs that prefer to be held closer or get anxious, a front carrier gives them the comfort that they might be looking for. Most backpacks also come with a clip or clasp that you can securely hook onto your dog to make sure they stay well contained inside the bag on your trip. So what are our top picks for dog carrier backpacks? One of our favorite dog carrier backpacks is the Pet ME Deluxe Pet Carrier. It's a comfortable and spacious backpack for your dog to relax in and even move around. The carrier is firm and it comes in 12 colors and it's best for pets up to 18 pounds. 
One of my favorite features of this bag is that it has two access points, which means that it's easier to get your pet into the carrier. Another one of our top picks is the Canine Sports Sack. The Canine Sports Sack is an excellent choice for carrying small, medium, and large dogs on long hikes or bike rides. It's a lightweight bag that's made of waterproof fabric and has mesh and foam shoulder straps. It also has pockets on the side that are expandable. This is a front opening bag and it has several clasps in the front for that you can use to secure your dog once they're inside the bag. The canine sports sack comes in five different styles, but the Rover is the biggest dog backpack carrier on the market with the ability to carry dogs from 30 to even up to 80 pounds. So another dog carrier backpack is the PetsFit Comfort Dog Carrier Backpack. This has a generous amount of windows this backpack is ideal for hiking and commuting and can fit pets up to 15 pounds comfortably and your dog will even have enough room to stand up and move around. One of my favorite features is that it has this removable bottom that's really soft for your dog to sit on, but it also makes it really easy to clean the bottom of the bag. This bag here is the Yonet Dog Carrier Backpack, which is ideal for pets up to 18 pounds. This bag is ideal if you like to go hiking with your dog. It has dual openings and plenty of mesh windows and your pet will love hanging out the back during your bike ride. One of my favorite features is that the top cover can be rolled back for more ventilation. And I also really like that it has this bottom removable pad that you can take out easily for cleaning. Another great option to consider is the Pet Gear Roller Backpack. This supports dogs of up to 25 pounds and is best for trips on public transportation or in the car. It comes in four different sizes to fit a variety of small dog breeds. This is a front opening bag and as the name suggests, this bag comes with wheels and can be rolled along with your pet inside. And it has a telescoping handle just like a suitcase which makes it really easy to pick up and carry. So another pet carrier that's out there in the market is the Paw Boo Pet Carrier Backpack. You can wear it with your dog in the front or you can wear it with your dog in the back. This is a fun stylish style for carrying around your small dog. It's made from breathable and durable mesh and canvas and the zipper, velcro and elastic leg openings stretch for your dog's comfort. It's also really great for puppies to keep them safe and contained and out of trouble. And here we have the Outward Hound Pooch Pouch Front Carrier. This is an excellent choice for carrying small dogs on the front. It's a lightweight bag and a secure carrier. It's made with weather resistant fabric and comes with mesh sidings for airflow. The pack comes in three different sizes and can fit pets up to 20 pounds. It's really ideal for elderly or disabled or anxious pets, especially because some pet owners like using this bag when their dog gets anxious around other pets and dogs seem more comfortable in it. It also has an inner clasp that hooks onto the collar and keeps the pet secure inside. So those are our recommendations for the dog carrier backpacks available in the market today. I hope that you found it useful when trying to determine what the right bag is for your pet and for the type of activity that you're looking to participate in with your pet. Thank you so much for watching.